Yo, what's up? Today I'm talking about Robot Stream. It's an animation, animated movie, whatever you wanna call it, about a depressed dog living in the crap hole that's New York City. So he realizes he's way too lonely and orders a robot to become his friend, then the relationship starts. They are happy, but the robot runs out of battery at the beach. So the remaining of the movie is them trying to live their lives while still remembering each other, with the hope of reuniting someday. Skipping spoilers, this reminds me of Studio Ghibli, but less fantasy and more alive like a reality check where instead of having ghosts and stuff you basically have the day-to-day -day life of a person in New York. Just reminded me how much I hate being broke. This is one of those social criticism kind of things like being lonely kinda sucks go out and make some friends. The art style is pretty cool, the animations are really well made, there's this transition which I found pretty cool, pretty creative, the songs are good and again back to the message. I would say it's about keep going with your life like you know how people take different paths in life and stuff but you still remember your school days and stuff. But then someday you're walking find someone who used to be your classmate then you think to yourself ah, he doesn't remember me. But the thing is you both remember each other and you both thought the same thing so then you go home and think what if we stuck to the plan and we got rich together. Maybe our kids could have been friends. Yeah, the message here is keep going with your life, don't be stuck to the past but don't let it go. People change and whatnot but at the end of the day they're still the same guy who was your friend long ago. So yeah, in the end they all have an happy ending, kinda. But here's also the thing, this can give people different interpretations like I can say this is all about moving forward while not forgetting about the past but someone else can say Money buys happiness. Bro had to order a friend, there's no way out of this misery. Anyways, the art is very good, pretty good movie, nothing mind-blowing, but pretty good. See ya.